Hey guys, Brian with English Mountain Outdoors. Uh, next challenge up in Spirit of the Woods is for making a basket from natural material. So I want to show you what I've got. I've got a bunch of honeysuckle. I got some of this smaller, greener stuff for the bottom of the basket where it's going to be kind of tight. And then I have some bigger stuff for around the top. And one of the other requirements was for some natural cordage, which I will be making from this. This is some bark off of some vines I found up here. So I'm going to sit here for a little bit and get started, and I'll be back shortly. So I got it started. Uh, took some of the cordage I made from this grapevine bark and tied these this five sycamore branches and then I've got some honeysuckle that I'm using for the weaving and you can see it's working well uh, small yeah but <laughs> I'm trying to make sure I get the requirements of a foot tall but uh, all I'm doing I'm taking this honeysuckle and stripping the leaves off of it. And let's see. Just running it around. It's fun. It's hot out here. I'm uh, out of my father-in-law's place this weekend. I actually had some materials gathered at home for this project. And we ended up having to come out here in house said he had to go out of town, so I had to improvise and there is not much left around here. He's been clearing his property off and a lot of the stuff I thought was here he is already chopped up and burned, so I found this honeysuckle growing out on the fence by the road. So that's what I decided I'm going to use. It seems to be working well though. I'm camping here again tonight. I may even, if I get this done, I may even make a uh, lid for it and stick it down in the creek with some bait in it. See if I can get a couple of crawdads or something. This fish, this creek is full of little bluegill and creek chubs and crawdads and bullfrogs. So if I had to stay here, I wouldn't go hungry, that's for sure. This is for the challenge, so wanted to uh, do it. This ain't gonna be the prettiest thing, but it will be a basket and it will work. I haven't weaved a basket since I was in high school. <laughs> My art teacher might appreciate it, or she might be sitting there yelling at me. Telling me what I'm doing wrong. Miss Fisher, if you're watching, I'm sorry. <laughs> I've got a little bigger stuff. I'm probably going to have to soak in some water. It's kind of dried out. So, I'm going to keep weaving and I'll get back to you. Probably won't do any more until I get her finished up. Or at least close to finished. But, uh, 
that's where I'm at so far. I've got the cordage, natural cordage, down here holding the bottom together, and then I'm just going to weave this honeysuckle the rest of the way up. All right, so I'll be back in a little while. All right, guys, I got her done. This is my natural cordage here. And I also have some right there tying the top together. That cordage was made from this grapevine or some kind of vine bark. And that's it. Uh, it's right at 12 inches. I was measuring earlier, so if you want me to get a tape measure on, I can show you. But this is it. It uh, didn't come out bad. Not beautiful, but that's it. So that's my entry. I will see you guys in the next challenge. Looking forward to it.